Why do tigers have stripes? Lots of animals have patterns and colors that make them difficult to see. Most use their camouflage to hide from predators, but some predators, such as tigers, also need camouflage themselves. Tigers hunt by stealth, and their stripes help to break up their outline as they slink through tropical forests or waist-high grass. This lets them get close to their prey, so they can launch a sudden and deadly attack. Which bird looks like a piece of wood? The tawny frogmouth, from Australia, is one of the world's best camouflaged birds. It hunts small animals after dark, but spends the day asleep in trees. During the day, it is almost impossible to see. It perches bolt upright, and its gray feathers make it look like a broken branch. It keeps perfectly still so that it does not give itself away. Who behaves like a snake in the grass? The gaboon viper is armed with deadly fangs. Out in the open, its intricate markings make it easy to see. When it lies among fallen leaves, however, its camouflage makes it disappear. Gaboon vipers hunt by watching and waiting on the forest floor. If suitable prey comes within range, they immediately strike. This viper has venom powerful enough to kill people. Which is the weirdest animal disguise? It's hard to imagine anyone wanting to eat a bird dropping. That's why some spiders and caterpillars use bird droppings as a disguise. They have gray and white bodies, and sit out on leaves, exactly where a bird dropping might land. To make their disguise convincing, they form a shape like a blob. Spiders pull in their legs, while caterpillars curl up. Which lizard plays hide and seek? The leaf-tailed gecko is expert at hiding against the bark of a tree. Compared to most lizards, it has a flat body. It also has a tail like a dried out leaf and gray skin with markings like cracks in wood. These geckos hunt insects at night. If a predator does spot it, the lizard can quickly shed its tail, a trick that confuses the enemy while it escapes. A new tail slowly grows back. Which insects disguise themselves as thorns? Lined up on a twig, tree hoppers are not easy to see. They have a special trick for survival, they look exactly like thorns. Behind their heads they have a hard shield, which stretches up in a thorn-shaped spike. Tree hoppers use their camouflage to protect themselves from hungry birds. What looks like seaweed on the move? Many fish use camouflage, but the leafy sea dragon has a clever disguise. Its body is covered with leaf-like flaps, making it look like a piece of drifting weed. It swims with its body upright, but its tiny fins make it one of the slowest fish. These sea dragons live off the coast of southern Australia, close to seaweed-covered rocks. If a sea dragon is washed up on shore, its leafy flaps soon collapse. When does a butterfly look like a leaf? Dead leaves often lie on the ground, so we hardly ever give them a second look. But in some places, they are not what they seem. The Indian leaf butterfly, from southern Asia, mimics dead leaves to keep from being seen. Lots of other insects, including moths and leaf insects, use the same kind of disguise. One this Indian leaf butterfly is resting among some dead leaves. Its beautifully camouflaged wings make it almost impossible to see. Two this is the same butterfly, seen from below, with its wings open. Its hind wings each have a tail that looks just like a leaf stalk. Three from above, the butterfly looks very different. These bright colors are only visible when the butterfly is in the air. If you like the video don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to encourage us.